Hello, my name is Adam Bean, and today I would like to take a look at how uh, Project Helidon builds Docker images because it is unusual and interesting. So let's take a look. And I would like to start with the Helidon micro profile as always and uh, copy the first lines here. And uh, just I would like to switch from interactive mode to, to interactive mode from non-interactive mode because I would like to be asked about some package names. So group ID is going to be airhex and the artifact ID, let's call it hell docker. And uh, yeah, package is fine and I would like to create it. So there should be hell docker and here it is. So now what usually happens in docker files, so I would like to create a stock, my stock Jakarta E templates Maven archetype and I'll call it JK, JK docker for Jakarta docker. And now it is also created. Now, what usually happens in my projects, um, so we are creating a base layer for the application server. So this is earhex slash Pyara or earhex slash Whitefly, or we are inheriting from CentOS, for instance, and using for Quarkus. Um, and uh, now, now let's compare it to Helidon. So in the Helidon case, so I would like to open the editor here. In the Helidon case, what happens is the following. If you take a look at the Docker file, it inherits from Maven Kala 3.6. So we are inheriting from the build image and it seems like we're adding the POM. We are running the tests and um, we are packaging and then we say done and we add the source image and so forth. And then we are building the runtime. So it's, it seems like that the entire build happens inside Docker. So let's take a look how it actually works. And also interesting here, as you can see, there are two layers. So this is the business logic. So this is the uh, business logic layer. And these are all the Helidon infrastructure runtime dependencies. So let's build the image. So try to do that. And now we are in hell docker again. And uh, now say docker build minus the air hacks slash hell docker dot and see what happens. So um, now the interesting part is it builds everything in the Docker. So this is the actually Maven output and this is the initial build. So this is the worst possible experience. So it builds the project the very first time and uh, it can take, I don't know, up to one minute. And um, what we also already see, it, um, it downloaded the base image uh, and this is uh, based on uh, OpenJDK 11 Slim, and we're using Maven 3.6 for uh, Java 11. And uh, it uses the work Helidon, and now it uh, runs the tests, okay? They are skipped, and then it creates the image. So everything took 41 seconds. So let's take a look at images, and just had uh, the first, uh, uh, let's say, three lines and we see there is an uh, airhex docker, uh, hell docker, there are 20 mechs and uh, there's, there's another project. So, um, and uh, yeah, the uh, core was a little bit larger because it comes with more dependencies, uh, um, but uh, it was built hell docker. So the interesting part is, uh, now if I would like to open that, and uh, just change something. So I would like to, for instance, now perform a business logic change. And this is going to be, let's say, uh, oh, so it comes, there's always something to delete in the example at least. So I would like to create some enterprise Java refactoring to make it leaner. So now we are removing the superfluous stuff. And now, um, and now let's build it again. So I'm already uh, curious. So let's see what happens. And um, so it, it builds the project again, the business logic, but it was significantly faster. And um, and if you go to Docker history, now in um, airhex, airhex slash hell docker, hell, hell docker, we see that uh, 70, seconds ago um, there was uh, there was the last layer this was the and then we got the the jars here and 23 hours ago I did the first experiment so there's the layering and seven seven months ago I built 
maybe it, 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 it is based on old Java images, but as you can see, the entire experience is layered and, um, and, uh, and yeah, unusual or really interesting way and productive way to build Docker images where the entire Maven process happens inside a Docker file and not outside. So interesting, interesting variant. So thank you for watching. See you at upcoming conferences, um, workshops, Airhex Live, my podcast. So see you in the internet. Bye.